straight to the assign line next. Camera two, can I have camera two next, please? Stand by on OS7. Coming to assign two. Can I have the OS for the studio, please? OK, everything's sounding good. Mixing to camera three. And presenters, presenters ready please. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Cut, go bam, cue. Hello and welcome to the BBC School News Report here at Wolstanton High School. Today's features are Rendezvous 21, Olympic Performance Week and Primary Schools Gear Up for Change. During this week, Year 7 students have been looking at what they would like to be doing in 2021. We're now across to our communist correspondent, Tamsin, who is reporting on our first story. Hi, I'm Tamsin. I'm just about to go into the Grand Hall at Wolstanton to see what students will be doing in 2021. Scientist, footballer, singer, truck driver, gymnast, dog angler, beautician, policeman, hairdresser, policeman, animator, boxer, soldier, games designer, hairdresser, games designer, wedding planner, actor, teacher, baseball player, hairdresser, chef. <laughs> to be a computer programmer when I'm older, or a vet, or a doctor, or a biologist. Rendezvous 21 is Wolstanton's new community project. It explores how we best meet the needs of today's learners, the children that will be 21 in 2021. Our world is changing at the most rapid rate in human history. The statement that really made me concentrate was the one about are you going to trust the internet in 10 years time? Personally, I think not, because if you look at the hacking and bad things that are going on now, in 10 years time, is it going to be more dangerous or less dangerous? The three things that will concern me in 10 years time are animal extinction, lack of money, and internet corruption. This is Tamsin reporting for the BBC. Back to the studio. Throughout July, students will be taking part in a range of activities to raise money for the campaign Adopt an Olympian. who has the latest on this venture. I'm just getting in some last minute training for our mini Olympics. On July 16th, primary school students will be filling this field to show off their sporting talents. I'm now going to hand over to Megan, who will tell us more about this event. So Megan, what's your role in this event? Well, I'm a member of the sports camps and I'm going to help run the event on the day. So, who will be involved? Primary schools in the local area and Will Stanton High School students will be helping them to coach them on the day. So, what will be happening in this event? There will be a range of athletic events from the 100 metres running race to the shot put. Thank you, Meg, and good luck with the event. We now cross to Danielle who is going to tell us more about the W Factor. And now back to the training for me. I'm just backstage at the W Factory while auditions are happening. Let's go and see what it's all about. I'm just going to.
going to talk to Kath, who's going to tell us more about the W Factor. Hi Kath, can you tell us what the W Factor is all about? Well, it's all about having a lot of fun, really, and it's all about raising money for the Adoption Olympian campaign. How can you get involved? Well, it's really easy to get involved. All you have to do is visit www.wolstanton.staffs.sch.uk. Thanks for that, and I hope it all goes well. Hi, I'm Kath, and welcome to the W Factor. I'm joined by one of the hopefuls. Hi, what's your name, and what are you going to do for us today? Hi, I'm Melody, and I'm going to sing! Marvellous. Now I'm joined by two budding young artists hoping to make it in the competition. What are your names and what are you going to be doing for us today? I'm Mercedes and I'm going to play the violin. Wonderful. And I'm Brittany and I'm going to sing. Well, good luck to both of you. I hope you do really well. Now I'm joined by two more contestants hoping to bring that little bit extra to the competition. What are you going to be doing for us today? We're going to mime. Okay, as you can see, the competition here is fierce. Back to you, Danielle. Wow, we've heard from the performers themselves. Back to the studio. Thank you for that report, Danielle. Any further plans to continue your stage career? I think I'll leave that to the professionals. Our last story of the day is about young primary school children worrying about moving up to high school. Well, Stanton High School has something very unique running at the moment. We cross now to Zoe, who is reporting more on this story. Every Thursday after school, 170 primary school children from around the area attend after school workshops at Wall Stanton High School. Activities are both fun and educational, which include martial arts, tennis coaching, alien science, and much more. Thank you for that report, Zoe. I'm afraid we've come to the end of our report today, but don't worry, because we're back at the same time tomorrow. It's a goodbye from me. Also from me. Thank you for watching.